like there's people that tell stories about them being certain places with Meech, but when you go to the real story, it's, it's almost more incredible than what the person actually says. The day was just crazy. We started early. We shot in Williamsburg, Brooklyn. Jay-Z was running the label at the time, and this was like priority, priority, and he showed up to the set, and it was a big deal. I mean, Jay was there for, man, he was there for most of the day. Jeezy had this, this, this uh, magnetic feeling because everybody that was somebody in New York showed up to that shoot. Cam was in the video, so everybody from that camp showed up. Lil Wayne came. You know, they all had these red Ferraris riding around. It was just a crazy, it was a, it was a crazy day. Jay-Z had a, uh, I want to say, a sky blue or champagne Maybach, and this is when they first came out. Meech drove up in two Maybachs. He pulled the Maybachs up, and he, I don't know if he purposefully did it or whatever the case may be, but he, he pulled them in in order to block in Jay's Maybach. You know, Meech was always friends with Diddy. Like that was his, that's, that's his boy. You know what I mean? That was always his boy. So I think for Meech, it was sort of uh, trying to assert his presence so that he wanted to make it so that Jay had to speak to him in order to get the cars moved or whatever. But there was no, it was no, let me say, it wasn't no beef at all. It was just sort of that I'm rich too. And I'm, I'm street, I'm street rich for real. You know, there's a lot of folklore about Big Meech, like the mythology of Big Meech. Mostly all of it is true. 